Hello everyone, JRDL96 here with a brand new unboxing and then you could tell by the title it's pro wrestling related and it's for The Undertaker. Now recently, in the last, like a few months ago, Undertaker started his own podcast, his own show, YouTube show or something like that called Six Feet Under. And Six Feet Under, you know, has some form of merchandise on this website called Nine Line Apparel, which is... Undertaker's kind of been known for wearing, and I'm pretty sure he's gotten, he, apparently he's gotten criticism for it. But this is the only place I could get this, you know, stuff for this. I wanted just to support The Undertaker and everything else and his, you know, little podcast show. Which is pretty good. You know, it's still kind of weird. And I like the name of the podcast. It's kind of fitting for The Undertaker. But just seeing him doing a podcast, I'm like, I never thought that would be the case. But, you know... That's just, that's his choice, and good for him. He's done, he's done everything he needed to do in wrestling, and he's trying to give back to the fans, and that's pretty cool, right? So here we are. I got these cool things here. I think I got two shirts and, I think, a sticker set. Let's see here. Let's see if that's the case. There's these things here. Okay, there's one. The stickers. Oh, God. <laughs> the stickers were kind of like attached to one of the shirts. Where's the other one? Okay. So, it came with this little sticker set. The, the, these three stickers here. Right here, we have this one that is literally the Undertaker's hat and long hair. BSK for life, which is reference to his, you know, little back, you know, backstage, you know, crew known as the Bone Street crew. And then you have this, you know, demonic looking devilish skull design with the BSK letters on, on the forehead of the skull. Pretty cool looking stuff like that so let's go to one of the first shirts that i wanted to showcase let's start with this one pretty cool looking shirt i will say uh so here we have the undertaker's deadliest of all time which is kind of a pun on the fact that he's the dead man and also another play on the greatest of all time he's the dote <laughs> And the A is the Undertaker hat and long hair. Deadliest at all time. There's also the nine line apparel logo on the right sleeve. And the, you know, the stripes are bones. Are bones. Which is funny. And this is a large, by the way. There's nothing else on the back of this shirt. But there is a, a design on the back of the other shirt. But we'll get to that later. So anyways, let's try on this shirt, shall we? So, this is what the shirt looks like. Very, very soft. Very soft material looking shirt. It looks pretty cool. I just felt like the design looked pretty cool with the, you know, Undertaker hat and the long hair kind of forming the a, letter A in, you know, the, I guess the term here. So, I just found that pretty cool. <laughs> okay thumbnail for that one done but uh now let's go on to the next shirt that we got here which is kind of more of a tie into the podcast show that he has now six feet under and this so what we got here is this shirt it's this undertaker you know cool looking t-shirt design it, it says six feet under it's the logo for the podcast show six feet under established 1990 which is when he debuted in that survivor series you have the nine line apparel logo with the bones on the on the right sleeve again but this is why i got the shirt and i hope wwe sells this on the website i do know this was an actual t-shirt on the site and it's because of this try me i'll make you famous which is a famous line that he would say during his big evil American badass days during the late 2001 to 2002. 
He even said it during his feud with AJ Styles. Try me. I'll make you famous. <laughs> he made Jeff Hardy famous. He made AJ Styles famous. <laughs> he made a lot of people famous. For not respecting him, <laughs> you know, and stuff like that. But anyways, let's try on this shirt now, shall we? So, this is what the shirt looks like. Very, very soft, just like the other shirt. But, you know, the reason why I got this shirt is mostly for this on the back, which is, you know, a nice reference to his, one of the catchphrases he had during his American Badass, you know, gimmick. The try me, I'll make you famous. You know, so... There's that, I guess. So here's the thumbnail for this, and I'm gonna try to include the stickers into this as well. It looks like I'm just, lit in a sense, kind of flipping you guys off. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just having some fun here. Anyways, yeah, that's really it. Thumbnail is really pretty much done at this point. Anyways, that's really it on this. That's really it on this unboxing. So the recap: we got this little sticker set of these, you know, three things. Based on Undertaker, you have this "Try Me, I'll Make You Famous" six feet under T-shirt, and then you have the deadliest of all time. The deadliest of all time. That's awesome. You know, right here. So, pretty cool stuff, right? So, I'm happy for what he's doing right now. Like, he's really obviously enjoying his retirement. And he doesn't need to wrestle again. I don't want him to wrestle again. I do not want him to be a Ric Flair. <laughs> or, you know, or Goldberg. You know? I just don't want him to wrestle again. I think, you know, he's done everything he needed to do. And then some, you know. And he's one of my favorites, you know, of all time. Uh, you know, just, you know, I just, I'm happy for him, you know. But uh, anyways, I'm happy he's doing this too, you know. And I'm hoping, and I'm hoping at some point, if this ever even happens, I don't even know if they ever will. He's got that one man, what the the one dead man show thing he has going on. He's got a couple shows coming up for like that's kind of is tying into some of the show pay per views, WWE pay per views. If there ever is anything in New York, like anything big in New York, like a SummerSlam or a Survivor Series or a, you know uh, anything that's you know leading up to you know a new york show i'm hoping the that his his you know dead man show is one of those things i want to meet actually i have i really want to meet the undertaker and thank him for being such a huge inspiration and also thanking him to for scaring the shit out of me as when i was nine years old <laughs> thinking that he was going to kill me in my sleep check out my story time video on that <laughs> if you want to know more um but I really want to get the chance to meet Undertaker and, you know, thank him for everything that what he's done. So I'm hoping that happens, but I just feel like <laughs> that may not happen. That may not happen, but you never know. Never say never, as you, say, as you always hear, especially with the whole CM Punk fiasco that has happened, you know. But um, anyways, that's really it on this unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed if you did the like button, subscribe, share this video with your friends. Be sure to ring that bell to be part of the notification squad. Be sure to check out my Instagram because I make cool as the Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, and myself. I also enact as cosplays on there, so go check it out. And be sure to check out my Tumblr and my Discord in the description as well. So until next time, JRDLA6 signing out. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.